Welcome back to Creepy Demon Lady. Welcome back to Caitlin Needs Some Water. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> huh? Oh yes, thank you. I'm terribly sorry, I cannot attend the trial today. Please accept my apology. I had a previous engagement as I had to watch over the trainees training today. Hmm, I guess he really doesn't want to talk about the picture. I get that oh, because the, oh, because the master can't be here with us, you understand? She looks so upset about it. And that's why with a lowly branch family member such as myself must do this. Yeah, she wants to head this whole fucking thing. She was totally behind it. Mm -hmm. Alright. Have you remembered anything about the murder? No, I told you everything I know already. Were you in this room the whole time Lada and I went to call the police? Yes, of course. I was by Mystic Cabbage's side the entire time. That was called her Maya. <laughs> I performed the spirit serving technique and held up my arms afterward. Hmm. You said that yesterday as well. Did anything else happen? I would like to say more did, however, that's all I had that occurred. Hmm. I suppose nothing happened in the end, good sir. Sorry to have played you on your hopes. Possibly be more patronizing. So, do the students train every day? Yes, absolutely. They were given a day off the day after the murder, of course. However, and I assume, and I assume both Cabbage and Pearls went through this training. Mr. Wright. Ah, yes, yes. Wow, she got real scary real fast. How many times must I tell you before you understand, good sir? They have to be addressed as Mystic Cabbage and Mystic Pearl. Oops, sorry, I mean Mystic Cabbage and Mystic Pearl. They sound like Pokemon training. Wait, I'm sorry, but Mystic <sighs> Pearl? Isn't that going a bit too far? Next question, please. Uh, no, I'd like to answer that one. Oh man, she's really being a pain in the ass about this. <laughs> Good ad lib. Please remember to watch not only what you say, but how you say it, good sir. Ooh. The mice. So the master is, um, Cabbage's mother, right? Mystic Misty. Oh, that's the picture she She's a at. brilliant medium. And where is she now? We're not sure. Not sure? About 16 or 17 years ago, Mystic Misty failed at channeling a certain spirit. After that, she simply disappeared. I don't believe she'll ever return to the village in any case. And in four years' time, her name will be forever erased from this village. Hmm. That's weird. Almost like you're counting down the days. Yeah. Erased? A person who's been away from the village for over 20 years is considered dead. Oh, I see. And that is four years from now for her. When that happens, a new master will be appointed the Kurain village. And? Mystic Cabbage was supposed to be the next master. However, with this murder, I'm afraid... Oh, here it comes. I must be imagining things. I thought she was laughing to herself for a second there. She kind of looks like she was. Not really. What do you think about this? I'm terribly sorry, but... I'm afraid my spiritual powers are not as strong as you might think. I really am terribly sorry. Are you? Are you really? Um, okay. Should we ask her about this? 
What do you think? I mean, you could. This. This is the key to this room. That's right. But why do you have a good sir? That I'm not telling. You return it at once. I can't. It's evidence, after all. I think she knows exactly how he is to this murder. That bitch. What is the feeling I'm getting? Feels... Hmm. Can't describe it. Do you recognize this knife? What do you think about this? Yeah, I should get to How about hmm. this? This is Mystic Cabbage's costume, isn't it? It's a shame. I never thought anything like that would happen to her. But we don't know that it was Cabbage that did it. Oh, poor Mystic Cabbage. Do you ever listen to anyone other than yourself? She only listens to you when you say Cabbage's name wrong. has me out of the office most of the time. I can go back tomorrow. Helping Cabbage should be my top priority now. Maybe? Whoop. Have we shown the key to, um, Pearl? We could try. Because if we showed it to Morgan and got a reaction... About this key, Pearls. We found it on the day of the murder, right? Sorry. You're good. Yes. Now where now where you found this key is very important. So please tell me, Pearls, where did you find this? Um, I found it in the incinerator. The incinerator? Did you talk about the one in the garden? The door on it was a little open, so I took a peek. When was that? Yes? Are you going to tell my mother? Huh? You mean tell Morgan what you did? Yes, if she finds out that I was playing in the leftover trash. I'm going spanking. Ow! Rude. Ah, gotcha. Well, let's keep it a secret from her then, alright? Hmm, the incinerator, huh? Sounds like a good place to search next. There we go. Okay, Phoenix. Let's go to the incinerator. Woo. That sounded bad. <laughs> Yay, murder. Hey, there's someone by the incinerator. Oh, looks like they noticed me. And now we're running uh. at top speed toward me. Oh, God. Oh, hey. <sighs> like... You're that dentist guy. Sure. Actually, it's Phoenix Wright, attorney at law. Nice to see you again. Oh, like, real suave. So, it's like my turn. It's nice to see you too. So, what's up? You're all out of breath. Uh, like, huh? Oh, like, you mean... Like, I'm just totally happy and, like, totally excited to be here? Excited? Like, I mean, there are so many things to, like, see. It's, like, the real deal here. Oh, really? For example? For example, like, that urn over there? Do you, like, know about it? All I see is an old cracked piece of pottery, but sure. I'm sure you're gonna tell me about it. That's right. I said she found the key inside the incinerator. I 
guess I should take a look inside for myself. This, this is from Cabbage's costume. There's blood on it. A tiny bit, but still. Blood scrap added to the corporate crate. So that must be the the costume of the person that actually killed him, because we have Cabbage's clothes. Yeah. So this is the other costume. Alright. Should we talk to What's Her Face? So someone tried to burn us. And this key was also found in there. Hmm. I get the feeling this incinerator played a crucial part in this murder. Bring it in for questioning. <laughs> yeah. Bring it into evidence. How about you, Splendid Garden? Did you see anything? <laughs> Put it on the list of witnesses. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we already looked at it. Alright. Alright, let's talk to this bitch. Is there some sort of legend connected with that urn? Like, yeah. It's like this village's treasure. It says, I am. Huh, didn't know that. And, like, it's sealed inside that urn? Um, it's? What are you talking about? Like, you know. Amy Faye Spirit? Who? Amy Faye? Who's that? Like, jeez, Mr. Smith, get with the program! Everyone knows the lady that founded the Cure and Channeling technique was Mystic Amy. Um, you don't have to get upset with me. So, like, as long as your spirit, like, lives in that urn, the spiritual power of the Fae family will stick around. Like, isn't that totally romantic? Not sure that's the word I would use, but okay. Uh, romantic, huh? If that urn is really as important as she says, it could be a vital clue. Any, I wanted to ask you about the murder. Oh my god, any, many. Okay. Any, I wanted to ask you about the murder. Murder? Dr. Gray's, remember? As if there's another one? Oh, that one! Like, you should have said so in the first place! I see so many murders every day. So, like, I totally don't know anything, because I was, like, sleeping in the side room. Well, that's not much help. Did you notice anything at all? Like, come on, what a total bore. I, like, totally have nothing to do with this, like, murder thing. That's what a murder would say. Mm. Oh, yeah, you only introduced Dr. Gray to current village. No relation, sure. Even if you were only acquaintances, that still means you knew him. Furthermore, your sister who died in that accident was a nurse at his clinic. This is a long silence. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Traffic accident. Alright then, why don't you tell me about your sister's fatal accident? Like, why? You think, like, it's gonna... It's got something to do with the murder? I don't know yet, but I'm trying to chase down every lead I can. Oh fuck, here we go. Lock and key. Should we... We can try. Okay. Like, what is it? Looks like I'm gonna need something to pry our mouth open on this one. Um... Someone get the crowbar! Yeah, just fucking pry your head off. Alright. Um, we could try the article. Yeah. I was gonna say share plays about the tops. Oh, okay. Well, we'll do, um, uh, and we're at episode end two. So, okay. Uh, take two psych locks. And, and calls in the morning. Yeah. Get a crowbar. Yeah. Adios.